Army. I have a billion dollar invention idea that I want to just give out to people. Just give away to anyone who wants it and everyone who wants it. So if you have a big company and you want to make it, go ahead. If you have a small company or if you're just working in a garage in Switzerland, here it is. Um, so the invention idea is a bicycle, but not just any you know typical six speed bicycle I want this bicycle to be super fast and still be pedaled by a human just going off human power so here's when I uh, drew up um, it's a very rough sketch because while well, I'm not very good at this and I don't have fancy tools and blueprint but I want to get this invention idea out there so it can start being made so what we got here is a typical bike um, this is just an x-ray view of what the box would look like and um, basically it just takes the simple math of torque and speed and multiplies it so as we know torque you have the small gear connected to a large gear via a chain and that creates torque. You can pedal um, really fast and you'll be going slow but you can go pretty much anywhere and carry a lot of stuff. And then over here you have the speed which is the big gear connected to a small gear via a chain and that uh, gives you just lots of speed. You can't really carry all that much but if you're going on a level surface you can go pretty fast and uh, these drawings right here are side drawing uh, showing that you can connect these sideways and that's what I want to do so you connect torque uh, you have the small gear connected to the big gear with the chain to make torque and you do the exact same thing but you connect the big gear to a small gear here so that this slow torque spin is also being applied to a small gear and then you connect it again to another big gear something like this so you have the small gear connected to a chain to a big gear connected directly to a small gear that's connected to a chain to a big gear and so on and so on and then after you have all of that torque you have a lot of torque for just one man and then you can start adding speed so you'll connect a big gear at the end of it to another big gear just like this just directly side by side and then by a chain like we have here you'll connect it to a small one to create some speed but by this point you'll be going like 0.1 mile an hour with a lot of torque so we'll need to do the speed multiple times because if this multiplies by 10 then you'll be going one mile an hour and so you do it again, you, go be, you can go 10 miles an hour. And then you do it again, and you can go 100 miles an hour. At least that's the idea. I'm not completely sure. Uh, this is just something that I thought of. And why wouldn't it work? Because you're giving yourself a lot of torque. And when you have a lot of torque, you can do a lot of speed. And then, so torque plus speed equals a lot of speed and power, obviously. But if you were to do this the other way, I would assume that the speed plus torque would probably break the chains. So you have to do, you probably have to do torque plus speed and make your bike that way. And this is kind of what it would look like as a diagram. Here are the pedals uh, connected to a chain to a big gear. And then he, this represents the box here that all of the other ge gears will be housed in and it's connected directly to a small gear then a chain to a big gear directly to a small gear chain to a big gear directly to another big gear chain to a small gear directly to a big gear and then chained to your massive wheels or tires and obviously it's a billion dollar idea and it doesn't just have to be limited to bicycles obviously having a bicycle that is super fast is very dangerous because they offer almost no protection you can go from a bicycle to a big bike or even a big car like an SUV or put this in a pickup truck 
the options are pretty much limitless and you can just have someone pedaling instead of um, having an electric motor or one that runs on gas or whatever. And then another idea is you can add all of this to like a drone setup. So you have like this bicycle set up here, but instead of it attached to wheels, have the whole setup go upwards to four or six or eight or stacked propellers or blades, like a drone, and then you can have a personal drone helicopter thing. But yeah, there's the billion dollar idea for anybody to work on. Um, go ahead and take it. Everyone take it. I'm going to try and send this out to as many people as possible to see if they can get working on it. I want to see some videos of prototypes and stuff. I'm excited to see this out. This is something I've been wanting to work on, but I don't really have the time. So here you guys go. This is yours now. Thanks for watching.